morning! I just got back from the gym and I'm about to have breakfast. Um, we have still some leftovers. What's this? Chicken. We gotta pick up some chicken. I was thinking about making some katsu tonight since we got panko bread as well. I'm gonna have some leftover beef steak. Mm -mm -mm. another sunny day I mean it's not there's tons of clouds outside but there's something about sunny days that really get me motivated to film videos and to do really uh, I don't know I guess to just be productive so I'm about to film what's in my purse video and it's also it's gonna be like a two for two for one video because there's gonna be a great giveaway so stay tuned. I'll have the video up tomorrow, Friday, which you know what Friday is, Hunger Games. I might, oh, I'll see who would want to see it with me tomorrow, because what I want to do is see it during the day, like maybe even at noon so it wouldn't be as crowded. I'm hoping. I'm just leaving my mom's house and I've been hearing from everybody that Bath & Body Works has the candles on sale, but don't tell Benji Bear. Whoa! Dang it! Ah! My purse toppled over and all my friggin' zipper was open. Anyways, um, and I just wanted to get, I'm not gonna get a lot, I'm just gonna get two candles, okay? Because I don't have any spring scents. So I'm gonna get pineapple mango and then. Actually, I think I'm just gonna get two of the big pineapple mango since they're two for 20. And one normally costs $20. And I know if I were to tell Benchy that, he's like, that's such a rip off, $10 for a candle, blah, blah, blah. But I like Bath and Body Works candles, so. That's what we're gonna do. Um, and also, Benchy and I are gonna look at more homes today. I'm hoping that whatever we look at will be promising. We finished our taxes so I think right now would be a great time to go house hunting. Especially the market, like the houses, there's a lot of foreclosed homes and short sales and everywhere I look there's like, you know, for sale signs. I keep telling Benji that this shirt he keeps wearing looks like a... <laughs> over there, huh? Looks like a fast food restaurant worker <laughs> shirt. It really does. It's Japanese. Oh yeah, babe. Can you please sing that song? He's been playing this song all morning. Wait. I actually downloaded it. I normally buy my songs, but I illegally downloaded it because you can't buy it. You cannot buy it? You can't buy it. Don't worry, it's playing right now. This is uh, the correct lyrics, everybody. Did I do the wrong lyrics yesterday? Yeah. Oh my god. So was I. I didn't know the right Did lyrics you? until people commented. Put that up. Yeah. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. When Jesus washed, Jesus washed, Jesus washed his sins away. Uh, yeah, in about 10 minutes. Okay, 10 minutes. We're gonna go house hunting in 10 minutes. I'm gonna look for my tripod so I can share with you the candles I bought. <gasps> so excited. So I know this is gonna look pretty ridiculous. But here's what I just bought at <laughs> Bath and Body Works. This looks a lot more than what I really had because, um, well, let me show you. See? I got two pineapple mango, which is one of my favorite scents, uh, spring scents. Oh, it smells like Hawaii or just tropical goodness. Pineapple mango is a must-have for spring. This is good. And they had like 20 new 
spring scents. There's a ton of them that I never seen before, so that was fun. But uh, oh, this was cool. It's sage cucumber. I ha I don't think I've ever seen this one before. It's a very clean, light scent. Like this one would smell really great in the kitchen. Sage cucumber. Ooh. I got this is new also actually I don't think I've ever seen this mango beechwood and it's like a mango scent but definitely more subtle this one this one smells amazing I don't think I've smelled anything like this pineapple beechwood it smells like a really good smelling store clothing store what store is that I think it's Abercrombie and Fitch maybe Mmm, this is so good. Well, that's all I got. I got four candles. I saved $40. Um, so we're going to burn this. I'm actually going to burn all of these this spring. Oh, this is one of the model homes. Oh, it smells good. Bathroom right at the entrance. It says to take off your shoes, honey. It says to take off your shoes. Oh, really? Whoa. It's nice. Let's see, this is upstairs. Ooh. There's the guest bathroom. Oh my god, how cute is this room? It's pretty tiny though, huh? small master too so I think it was a no-go of the house just didn't fit the vision I was looking for so we'll just continue later I'm about to prepare a dinner we're gonna have chicken katsu it's gonna be a treat today I haven't had it in a while but you know what Oh, I don't think we got katsu sauce. I remember months ago we were looking for katsu sauce and I don't think we ever got around to buying some. Dang it! Here it is, breaded katsu. It's crying right now. I don't really know how to fry katsu, so um, it's chicken. I don't want to risk it, so I'm just letting it cook. And since we don't have katsu sauce, Benji's like, well, just look up how to make it. So I have um, some sauces here to form up a concoction that will somehow make tonka um, katsu sauce. So we're gonna experiment. I'm gonna open up a coconut. I've been getting much better ever since I came back from the PI. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Do you eat the meat? Yeah, I eat the meat. Benji just got back from Taekwondo. Whoa, that's gonna be an intense juice. Oh, yeah. Hey, I think this will work. I think it tastes like. Wait, what'd you put in it? Um, Worcestershire sauce, uh -huh. ketchup black pepper, and a little bit of sriracha. Here's our dinner. We have katsu with brown rice salad. Oh, this um, coconut spinach smoothie that Benji just whipped up, and it's delicious. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, it tastes so good. You can't even taste the spinach. Our plates are smelling so good. Woo! Guess what? We're going to watch The Hunger Games, not tonight, because I know it does premiere tonight at 12 a.m., but we're going to watch it tomorrow at 12.30 p.m., so 
Hopefully it won't be crowded because most of the kids are at school. So I am so excited to go tomorrow. Uh, I know some of my girlfriends want to go see it, but our schedules conflict. So I cannot wait. I'm like, I really want to see this. I asked Benji if he could come with me, so he is. And um, if my girlfriends want to see it again, I will be down to see it again. Yes. Thank you, honey bear. Some books I just got recently. So as you know, I really enjoy reading Anthony Bourdain or watching his shows. So these are the books that I got. I got um, Kitchen Confidential. This is his original book. Anybody that loves food will love this. It's cool. He wrote it a while ago, I think like almost 15 years ago. But this is Anthony Bourdain's regular or original book that got him popular. And then this is called The Belly of Paris, about a guy that eats food in Paris. And then this one, The Whole Beast Knows to Tell Eating. I'm not really sure what it's about, but Anthony Bourdain recommended both of those. So I'm reading that. And then also I'm reading this other one right now. It's called Lease Options and Subject to Deals. I'm a kind of a dork. I love reading books about real estate because I think it's very interesting. Anyways, I'm, I'm in here all by myself because I farted out there and she's not very happy with me because my fart's been stinking lately. Hi, honey. Hi, babe. She's still mad at me. I'm in a blanket because I'm so cold. Why are you so cold? I'm so cold because the door is open. <laughs> Should I close it now? You should ask why the door open. <laughs> oh, they all know. Trust me. They all know. I've been farting so much. I think it's the eggs. I'm not sure. But I've been working out a lot. And uh, maybe I've just been eating weird stuff. I don't know. Judy swears it's... Judy thinks it's the my seaweed that I eat. But I don't know about that. About to show y'all. Well, I've been watching this chew on this. It's like TED Talks. Philadelphia what? was so good. Okay, Judy is trying to say Philadelphia was good. That was a good movie. It's about a gay person fighting for uh, discrimination uh, case. I watched Forever Strong last night. That was really good. That was right. One Nation Overweight. Uh, what else did I have I watched? Oh, Kevin. Food Kevin. Inc. Good stuff. Think about watching this. I think this would be kind of interesting. Okay. Look, eating fries. This guy proves you can lose weight eating french fries. Judy would love that. Huh? Fries are my favorite. Judy would love to eat fries all day and that's it. <laughs> okay, never mind. Fries and ranch. It's peanut butter and banana with cran dried cranberries. And I have a bunch of blueberries. Benji's. And it's the savory breakfast. Sing it, Whoopi. Well, Whoopi doesn't sing this part. Oh, yeah, you're right.